Aloha. My name is Tara Grace, and I am 100% in support of the initiative temporary moratorium on GMO crop. When I sit here in the chambers and I listen to the people of Molokai, very deeply concerned about their jobs, my heart breaks. It really does. The empathy. And I think about Chinese, and they say, the symbol for crisis equals opportunity. In a day where the vocabulary includes the words like sustainability, organic, etc., there are so many brilliant farmers out there showing soil remediation, environmental scientists coming and talking about the benefits organic. It, there's no argument, really. How can one justify chemicals versus organic? So, on that note. The other is, it's an election year, and I am personally paying very close attention to candidates that include the word sustainability in their vocabulary and meet the candidates evenings, and so sad and depressing to not hear that word very often. There are a few courageous stand-up people who are using those words, and they are running, and I am supporting them. I won't mention those names, but keep an eye out. They know that language. I know for a fact that all the county council members on Friday were delivered as a gift from the creator of the film, the genetic roulette, as a means to educate the council, because I have personally asked and have a number of you, you know, what's your position on this moratorium? I don't know enough facts. I'm not sure. Well, I'll tell you one thing. I am one of your constituents who are paying attention to how much you are paying attention or not paying attention. And so you all have that video. I hope you took the weekend to pay attention for an hour and a half and watch it to see how the whole wide world has something to say. 52 countries have banned GMO products. Two minutes. And we are the seed bank for the world. And that is why I oppose GMO food in my home. 